Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Quick Scopes. Today we have the Air Force One off white mid, and that is in black, clear black. Free the box. Woo. Very, very nice. Let me take this opportunity to ask you to like. Oof. Through the inside of the box. Very, very nice. And the paper. Like. Leave your thoughts. Subscribe. Ring that notification bell so you don't miss a video. Ah, yeah. Purchase links for these in the description if available. Stay tuned for the on foot. So, yeah. Let's start from the soles up. So we have a very, very interesting outsole. We have a black outsole, regular Air Force One, and we have this, these pink panels with spikes on them. Very interesting. The spikes are rubber and they will wear over time. Or you can encourage the process by cutting them off. The midsole. We've got a very interesting midsole. It's a black midsole with a black midsole stitch. No Nike Air present as we have an air unit right here in orange. And on this side of the midsole, the lateral side, you'll see that you can see the um, spikes around the side as well. And that outsole going into the midsole, pink, blue and green. Remember, you can cut off the spikes. If we go to the lateral the medial side, sorry, of the midsole, you'll see that we have this block right here containing the same colors as on the other portion with the spikes. And you'll see that the air unit is absent right here. So the air unit is exposed only on one side. Very, very interesting. And then to this upper. So this upper is quite interesting. It's made of a kind of like translucent um, netting mesh kind of material as you can see so if we start from around the toe you'll see that material right here it's a very very weird material similar but not similar to some of his previous Air Force Ones so going around the toe we've got that black material and we've also got it on the toe box and it's more translucent on the toe box going up the shoe you'll see that we have a very, very interesting eye stay. Um, it's just little eyelets right here. And we have this overlace right here in white. Black laces, a little too thin for me, but it is what it is. Um, it's similar to the overlace. Um, and then going up the shoe, we have a tongue of the same material as the toe. We have a lace lock right here in pink and yellow. And then at the top of the tongue, we have the air and the swoosh in a sort of graffiti font. And that is embroidered. Very, very nice. That's in white. As this is a mid Air Force One, you can see that we have the strap right here. And this is composed of a grayish black ripstop material. If we go to the mid portion of the shoe, you'll see again, we've got the same panel as on the rest of the shoe that black sort of mesh um, pattern. And we have a clear swoosh. This swoosh is transparent and it is lenticular and you can see where it's stitched in to hold it onto the shoe, right on the belly of the swoosh and to the peak or near the peak of the swoosh. And we've got a little orange panel there as well. If we go to the medial side, you'll see that we have the same swoosh, but we've got that writing, that printed writing as you see on most off-white um, products right here. That address, very, very nice. Going back to the lateral, if we look at the foxing, you'll see that we've got the base, we've got that little plastic mold cup right here. And again, that little orange tab. But on the medial side, you'll see that we have the same material as on the strap. So the strap material that ripstop is present here but it's not on the lateral going to the foxing we've got a transparent heel loop right here and that goes down beyond the heel tab to that cup right here and we have the black nike air on a black panel which is similar to the rest of the shoe 
we take a look inside the shoe, we've got a black sock liner and a black insole which features the off-white hands and face design. Very, very nice. Let me know what you think of this pair. For me, an exceptionally interesting pair, to say the least. I've never seen a mid like it. It does remind me of a Vandal a little bit by the way that the panels are, you know, connected and all of that. It's like a sort of stitched um, nubuck right here, the way the panels are connected, but it is a very, very interesting shoe. A little too interesting for my taste and liking. Um, I think if this was just a standard Air Force One outsole and midsole, it would have been quite nice. Um, the air unit is welcome. It is welcome. It's a wavy air unit as well. And this does remind me of the Air Force One Elite, I think it is, um, from a few years back. Um, as I said, the air unit is welcome, but these spikes, I'm not sure about these. It's a bit weird. It doesn't even allow the shoe to sit down um, straight because of the spikes. But as I did say, these will wear out um, as you walk in them, so it's not too bad. Or you can cut them off, speed up the process. What do you think of this pair? For me, I give these a six out of 10. As I said, a lot going on, not really to my taste. It's a bit too much in my opinion. Not forgetting, we also have the orange tag as well on this shoe. But yeah, let me know what you think. Remember, purchase links for these if available in the description. Stay tuned for the on foot. Don't forget as well, there is a white pair of these and I have done a review of those, so check out that review. And let me know what you prefer, this pair or the white pair. Anyway, thank you for subscribing and supporting, sharing your thoughts here is always appreciated. I've been Scopes, signing out. See ya!